this purple fall smoky eye for you guys. I think it would be perfect for a evening out or even to go to like maybe any kind of like fall parties or anything like that. Um, I love the like really deep purple as a smoky eye. It doesn't look like too harsh or too dramatic. I used a lot of like warm colors in the crease so it really balanced out the purple and um, the smokiness of the look so it didn't look like you have like a black eye or anything like that. All the products of course will be listed below and if you want to see how I got this look just keep watching. So to start out the look we are going to just put a matte soft brown and that is from MAC Cosmetics. I just use that as my transition shade and I'm just going to blend this in with a big fluffy brush and I took that from inner corner to outer corner and then I'm going to repeat the same step on the other side as well. Next I'm going to take a smaller tapered brush and I'm going to put Makeup Geeks, I believe it's Beaches and Cream in, or no it's Peach Smoothie. I use Peach Smoothie and I'm just going to put that on the crease of the lid. And it's just going to give the purple that I'm about to lay down all over the lid a little bit more dimension and a little bit more of like an orangey kind of warm fall colors. Hello. So to prep our lid, I'm just going to use this Jordana eyeliner and this is just a darker purple liner and what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to put it super close to the lash line and then I'm just going to fade it up towards the crease of the lid and this is just gonna, going to create a base for the darker purple eyeshadow to stick on to. So hopefully they could rely some more we are the same Rather it's different color, different image, different name We all hope for sunny days but only get the rain I know exactly how it feels when you all alone Thinking no one wouldn't care if you dead and gone Like how they get through all this pressure Do I keep it strong but have to find my own therapy within this microphone I am going to use the Anastasia Artist Palette and I took the shade Deep Auburn out of here. I believe that was the color, but I will list everything below so you know what colors that I use. But what I'm going to do is just pack this deep purple color all over the lid. No additional product on the brush. I'm just going to blend both of the crease color and the lid color together. I just like a more seamless look. I don't like so many harsh lines to my eyeshadows. How are you? It's so typical of me to talk about myself. I'm sorry. I hope. I'm just tight lining here with that same purple Jordana eyeliner that I used and it's just going to give my lashes a fuller look which I am really liking and it also is going to make you look a little bit more smoky as well. And moving right on to foundation, I believe I used the Too Faced Born This Way foundation but again I will list everything down below. I'm not 100% sure what that foundation was. I know I was mixing two colors here. I believe it was the Born This Way foundation and the uh, Smashbox BB Water Foundation as well. So again, all the products will be listed below and yeah, I'm just going to blend this out with a Real Techniques brush. So you, this Real Techniques brush is one of my favorite brushes and you can find it at Ulta for like $10 or so, so it's a really good brush to have. So now I am just going to pop 
pop on some lashes. I believe that these are the Sephora Collection lashes in the style Celebrity. They're in the three pack of lashes. But after I have those popped on, I go ahead and set my face, which I did do off camera as well as my brows. Um, I always set my face off camera just because I feel like it's super pointless. But just in case you guys want to know what I use, I do use the Rimmel Stay Matte Powders. I think they are the best for setting the foundation. So now I'm just going to use some blush. This is the Sephora Collection Blush in Flirt It Up number 6. So I'm just dusting that on my cheeks and now we are going to move on to the lip color which is the Christian Dior Lou, uh, Rouge Velup Lipstick I believe in the shade Princess. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.